Finn is here to figure out what his future holds. Uh, Finn, what's going on? Um, well, I'm 24 years old. I'm yes. From Chicago. Yeah. Um, recently, I've went through a lot of changes in the last two years. Um, yeah. I used to be 90 some pounds, if that. I'm um, all through high school, and I've gained 100 some pounds in the last two years, um, weightlifting. Yeah. Um, but you seem fit. You're... Yeah, I can show you. Yeah, well, okay. Oh, I'm sorry. I thought I was looking in a mirror. <laughs> okay, so you're here. Uh, do you know why you're here? Um, yeah, I'm kind of like two girls. Um, interested in both of them. They do know oh. each other. Oh, so they're basically you're going to figure out which of the two you would like to date. Yeah, yeah. They both um, like have so expressed they... interest in you, haven't right, they? Right, and I've expressed interest in them. So. Uh... Oh, okay. Well, why don't we meet them, Catalia and Aubrey? Okay, let me first find out here. Uh, you are, which one is Catalia? I am. You're Catalia. Hi, Jerry. Okay, and you want to tell us about yourself? Just yes, friend. I'm here because I want to be with you. You and I have been talking on Facebook, and I love that your exterior doesn't match your interior. And I think that you and I would be great for each other. And I love that me being trans doesn't matter to you. Oh. Oh, you're transgender? Yes. You're transgender and that's... Yeah, that, bisexual. That's great. You're bisexual. That's good. Okay. Very good. And, uh, and you are Aubrey or... Aubrey. Aubrey. Yes. And uh, what do you want to say to him? So, Finn, you know, ever since we've gone to school together, I've had a really big crush on you. And I know a lot of the other girls liked you, but they didn't like you for you. They liked you for who you seemed to be and what you looked like. And I really want to be that special person in your life and like you for you. Okay. And, you, and are you transgender as well? I see that's why I really like Finn is because I am transgender yeah. and uh, he treats me like a woman. He doesn't treat me like an object like my other ex-boyfriends have. Yeah. And he really is a sweet and compassionate guy. Well, super. Okay. Very good. Yeah. So, uh, what do you want to say, or how are you going to determine who you want to be with? Um, well, first of all, I want to ask like three main questions, stuff I think it's important that I'd ask anyone yeah. before a relationship. Um, so, the first question is, if we were going to go on a date, um, where would you guys take me? I would take you to the 21 seat Metropole in Cincinnati, since you love art so much. It's a restaurant and an art museum, and they have very intricate pieces there. And I think that the pieces there resemble some of the pieces that you make, that you show me on your Instagram. Okay. <laughs> that, that's well, insane. Finn, you know, I know you're not very bougie like some people and don't like all the fancy stuff. So I figured we could do a nice romantic, maybe picnic underneath the stars to get to know each other and see where things go. <laughs> very good. <laughs> Okay. Um, What's your next question? So my second question is, I'm a big painter, I'm an artist. Um, if we were a couple, what would our symbol be? Actually, we should, we got canvas and stuff. Well, uh, of see. course, we have canvas here, don't we? Yeah. Let's <laughs> yeah. bring out the canvas. Oh. Oh. Very nice. And we 
put that here. Oh, you get your, yeah, get your brushes all the way. Oh, that's very nice. Because you're an artist, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. I've been okay. a painter for, since I was a kid, so. Yeah, watching them, do you think they're artistic as they're drawing this, or they're kind of like me, they don't know what they're doing? Um, I definitely go at it a different way. But. Yeah, it's a different way to go around it. Yeah. Yeah, I do like that in the third grade. <laughs> No, I'm just teasing. It's, 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 yeah. Oh, my. Yeah. Yeah. I, I don't want to say anything, but you would not be D1 if this was... Uh, <laughs> yeah. That's very good. Are we done now? One at a time shows? Okay. This is the symbol of you two together. So, the symbol that I drew is two hearts together combining as one because Finn's is mine and I want to be with him and if he gives me the chance I want to show him I look at that it's self-explanatory okay now let's look at the other one okay. that's going to be tough to beat so, show the audience. Mine. This is, oh, what? Ooh, that was a nice reaction I know there. Might be a little hard to understand, but my symbol for us would be two swords, and the fire would be igniting our love and fire for each other. Oh. <laughs> yeah. And the two swords make sense. I mean, you wouldn't do a sword and a donut. <laughs> um, well, I definitely like the, the art, so thank you both for that. Um, my third question is, I feel like the first kiss um, kind of tells what everything's going to be about. Maybe there's a spark. So I was going to see if we could both try that out and see what happens. Yeah. Okay, uh, uh, no swords were involved. <laughs> okay, so what, there you go. Uh, now, I guess it's decision time, right? You can choose which of these two lovely uh, ladies you would like to be with. Well, Jerry, um, girls, I mean, I, I appreciate everything. I love the art. Um, I love the date ideas, but fortunately, I'm going to have to go with Kat because I just, I feel like that represents us better. Um, and I felt a little more with the kiss, so um, I feel like you just kind of get my way. So. We'll be back. Thanks for watching. Now please approach the bench. The way I look at it, you have two options here. Option A, watch more Judge Jerry. Option B, watch more Jerry Springer. The choice is yours. Now get out of my courtroom. You have more clips to watch. Don't forget to subscribe.